Thousands of unemployed people here in Washington state could have their benefits cut off in the coming weeks. Congress has yet to reauthorize money for emergency unemployment. And KXY 4's McKay Allen is here. Now, McKay, there is a real fear out there about this, isn't there? Uh, there is. There's between about 2 million, 2.5 million people nationwide that would likely be cut off from federal unemployment before the end of the year, unless those benefits are extended. Some say that will cripple unemployed families. Others say it will merely hasten their job search. I think it's about the worst thing they could do. Outside WorkSource today, there is real fear. Fear of unemployment benefits ending. I think now's when they need it the most, and, and the government should not stop it. No, the government needs to, to uh, keep funding it. Right now, unemployment works like this. The first 26 weeks of benefits are paid by the state. For decades, this 26 weeks was the only unemployment. But during the recession, Congress has repeatedly lengthened unemployment, paying unemployment benefits for 99 weeks. But now the law authorizing many of those extensions has lapsed, meaning thousands of Washington families could be dumped off unemployment early. Are you seeing people, more people, mm -hmm. perhaps be a little more aggressive now that their benefits are ending? Absolutely. I would say in the last probably 30 days, we've seen an increase in candidates responding to job postings. Nancy Nelson owns Humanix, a Spokane staffing company. She says now that benefits may be shortened, many unemployed are suddenly more motivated to find work. We do have, I think quite a few people are saying that, that they, their benefits are running out and realize they need to be more um, aggressive and more um, pursuing their job opportunities. And she says many of the unemployed she tries to match with jobs are suddenly more willing to take jobs they would not take before. Now, I, as unemployment benefits are coming closer to an end, I think they're looking at those opportunities, whereas maybe in midsummer they were waiting, at, waiting and holding out. Senator Murray actually spoke on the Senate floor earlier today, begging the Senate to reauthorize the unemployment bill and keep the benefits for the full 99 weeks, saying it would be devastating to cut families off from unemployment. But conservatives say continuing unemployment, it simply de-incentivizes job search. They say there isn't enough money for it. Extending it would cost about $5 billion a month. Reporting in the newsroom, McKay on KXOY4 HD News.